Hey lovelies, thank you so much for tuning in. If you're new here, hi, I'm Lena. I am actually sitting in the parking lot at Hooters. I'm about to go in for my shift. I wanted to do a week at Hooters for me, like what a week would look like, and I think I am gonna still do that, but this particular topic that we're gonna be doing today is gonna be about how to entertain your tables. This is gonna be real short and simple. I'm literally gonna tell you guys probably a couple things hold on let me lock my lock my car i don't know there might be some weirdos out here so, how to entertain your tables one when people come into hooters i guess they are kind of expecting like a certain experience so especially if you have like a guy who's by himself or he's waiting for another guy friend to come along or even if they're already both sitting down at the table, it is extremely important that you greet them like, hey, how are you guys doing? Be the conversation starter. Even though it seems really awkward, and trust me, it literally is so awkward for me, ask them, what brings you in today? And then based on what they say, it just keeps going. Like if they say it's their first time ever, be like, oh wow, really? You've never been in a Hooters before? There's so many things that could stem from you saying, what brings you in today? If they like to talk and they're not seeming like they wanna be left alone, which is like 90% of the time, they're gonna keep talking and then you're gonna keep talking. Another way is use your uniqueness use whatever makes you unique you know there's certain things that are conversation starters like if you have a boob job if you're funny make a joke there is so many things you can say what makes me unique <laughs> besides my hair being super curly is that i have this birth com birth control patch right here and i have so many people asking me what it is and so i'll be like yeah it's a birth control patch you know a lot of people think it's a nicotine patch and i'm like no i don't smoke i get kind of offended and then that's a conversation starter within itself so find something about you that could be a conversation starter if your belly button is pierced because we're allowed to have piercings now um that could be a conversation starter you know change out your jewelry because that could be a conversation starter there are so many things you guys that you could say something like oh did y'all just get out of work you know because you can tell some people have like their construction uniforms on or oh where do you guys work da, 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 da. like if you if you see that they have a laptop be like oh what you working on literally anything typically when they have laptops they're not really wanting to speak too much but you can still engage you can still say hey what you working on you know just something really cute and simple it doesn't take a lot and if you are having to go like above and beyond like doing backflips for a table then they're just bored with their lives like it doesn't take that much you know sometimes we hula hoop we do our birthday songs those are entertaining but like other than that you really don't have to sit there and just make up lies you know i mean if you would if you want to come off more interesting of course you can fib a little no one knows you for real you can just tell them you know i'm interested in this look up sports look up different things and do your research do your homework and engage like just engage it may be tedious it may be like awkward at first but going in and just saying hey how are you guys and then especially if a guy is by himself ask ask what brings you in today it's so simple and you could get a regular that way it's it's so simple yes like I said a million times, it can be very, very awkward. And it's awkward for me because I'm like, I hate small talk. I don't know why I'm asking these questions, but they love it. They love being felt like they love feeling like they're important. Like you really, really want to talk to them. And maybe you don't at first and then you realize, wow, this person is really cool. They have some substance. They're, they're a human. Like, you know, they're funny. Next thing you know, you have a regular. Entertaining doesn't necessarily mean like doing the most. You don't have to do the most. Even a simple just sitting there complimenting someone, you know, I really like your nails. Or I had this one lady, this is another conversation starter. It, so if the table wants a beer, we have to check the IDs, even if they're like 80 years old. I'll be like, uh, for uh, policy purposes I do have to see your ID I know it's extra but I just have to do it and then they'll be like oh yeah because I'm 
I'm 20 years old again or like I look like I'm a teenager or something you know and I'll be like yeah you're so young or be like no you know it's just the policy and then you know you could go even further and uh, tell them how y'all keep getting stings and like people keep coming in and not checking IDs and this is an issue for your store now so further explaining why you have to check the IDs could be a conversation starter because I had this lady who I kind of explained extra into detail about why we have to check the IDs with every single person now and she told me about a story about her restaurant like she's a manager at a restaurant and how um, they had a server who didn't uh, check the IDs correctly even though they said that they did and they they were fired so I learned that without even having to ask like I just further explained something so even giving further explanations as to why you do certain things or why you do this why you wear this could literally lead to a conversation just keep it simple and sweet don't do anything you're not comfortable with like honestly I'm not gonna go up to the table and be like knock knock like no cuz I'm not funny and I'm not gonna try to do something that I'm not personally comfortable with so just do what works for you um, if these tips and tricks were helpful please let me know and I will see you guys in the next video mm, bye